Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. To be able to assign account numbers, you will first need to turn on the account number function. Click the gear icon and select Company Settings from the Settings heading. Click the Advanced link on the Settings page. Under Advanced, you will see Chart of Accounts. Click this section to expand it. You will see a checkbox for Enable Account Numbers. Check this checkbox to turn on account numbers. To be able to see your account numbers in transaction forms and reports, check the Use Account Numbers checkbox as well. Click the Save button to save your changes, and then click the Done button to close the window. After you have turned on account numbers, click the gear icon and select the Chart of Accounts link under the Settings heading. Alternately, you can simply click the Transactions link in the navigation bar, and then click the Chart of Accounts link below that. At the top of the Chart of Accounts list, click the Pencil icon. Clicking the Pencil icon opens a page that displays your Chart of Accounts. The Number and Name columns are now text fields where you can enter or edit the account number or name of your accounts. In the Number column, you can enter the account numbers associated with your bank account, or you can assign your own account numbers to any account for internal tracking. Account numbers in QuickBooks Online Plus can only be up to seven digits long. In the Name column, you can assign any name to any account. Click the Save button to save your changes and close the page when you're finished. It is important to note that when you add an account number, the sorting order will change in the chart of accounts. The accounts to which you assign numbers will be listed in ascending numeric order by account number. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.